In this video, I'm gonna show you how I researched, came up with the design, and listed on Merch by Amazon. All right, so I was doing some research. I came over here to merchresearch.com, left everything blank, and picked the product and, you know, the marketplace and hit search. Nice. It brought me over to this, and I left everything as is, hit the 30, the last 30 days, which was right down the bottom. It gives you the options. You look at it, gives new arrivals, last 30 days, last 90 days, hit last 30 days. Okay. Um, and then when I come down here, I was just looking and seeing what is new. What is new? What's going on? What's popping out? Okay. Um, and this popped out right here. Teaching second grade on Tuesday. Two, 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 two. All right. And you can see that freaking BSR. It is crushing it. Right. And I was like, what is this? What the heck's going on? So I clicked on it, wanted to look into it a little bit more. And obviously by looking at the design, you can see this date, right? And it's only good, obviously for this year. Hey, it may be even a souvenir, you never know. But I was researching this and I was like, this is an interesting niche that I found, okay? Um, and I dropped it in a little bit more, like see what else, like when was this design uploaded? You can see it was uploaded on the second of january then i did a little bit more research and you're thinking like maybe this niche is a little bit too late to upload to people are uploading designs as of today yesterday and all this whole month right and they're making sales like right now and what i literally did to figure out what was going on about the niche i just did a search okay like what is like what is like a search on google what is it what the heck is going on what is it it's basically you know february 2nd 2000 two two okay um it's tuesday <laughs> so it's it's interesting to see that type of stuff um and obviously if you're one of these people that got ahead of this type of trend you're uh you know you're making a ton of money right now so um i went ahead and researched okay then uh the niche creating a design and i'm gonna show you the design and, and we're gonna put it together a listing for this video and see if we can you know make some last minute sales before this trend dies off. Now, I did a search over here on Amazon because I wanna see what keywords that are ranking over here on Amazon and what's populating. So I can have an idea of like who I'm creating the design for, right? Because the keywords tell you a story. So Tuesday, 22-2, second grade, you can see kids, you can see teachers, first grade, birthday, second grade, math, long sleeve teaching. Okay, so you're seeing like different ideas are popping up and you know, who are you gonna be targeting when you're creating this design? And this is part of the research tool as well because this is some of the work that you would have to do on your end to get a better understanding, but which is really cool that Amazon provides this type of you know information for us because you can see people, it's all obviously showing like maybe you're typing this in and this is maybe, this is what you want if the customer's typing in this you know shirt idea or product idea or keyword phrase, whatever it is that you wanna call it. Um, what I also did was come over here to Helium 10 and I seen a Tuesday 22-2 shirt, right? But you can see like the competing products right here, which is really interesting. Now, this may be different by the time I published this video, but this right here, this is a perfect, you know, this is a perfect keyword phrase that I will use in my listing for my design. Also, the tool that I'm using right here is the AMZ Suggested Expander. It's a really awesome tool that shows you a lot of good keywords. All right, now, so I went ahead and threw a little bit of a curveball, right? Um, I, the design that I came up with was Wine Tuesday, and you can see two 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 right um this is the design it looks good you know this is it looks good on a, a, a black standard t-shirt if you look at it right here and then i uploaded to a, a few other colors too um it doesn't look good on the red as you can see right there but you can see you know the creativity right here okay just a, it's a funny little you know saying in the wine niche but i'm applying it to tuesday Okay, so I, I made sure that it looked good on a black t-shirt. Okay, pretty much all the darker colors, right? And I don't have it checked for youth. So don't check it for youth because you get a rejection. And then I made it look good on the lighter colors too as well. Okay, 
um, so it looks good on a white t-shirt so and then this is what I mean too um, if you guys have been following me for this long um, for a while you know that I say that if you can make it look good on a light colored t-shirt just by you know switching some colors around on the design do it because then it will generate more sales um, and it creates more opportunity for you to make a sale okay so you can see exactly what I did right there I used a productor too to um, resize it for you know the sweatshirt over here okay and this is a hoodie the pull look not the sweatshirt but the the pullover hoodie and the, the zip hoodie so that's really cool um it's a really easy resize you just come up here to this little button right here then you come over here to hoodie then i'll resize the design for you on this page and then you just upload it right so yeah this is the design right here a little bit of a curveball like i said i was planning on doing something else and i was like wait up this is a good idea right here let's try this 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 is a really creative design and i like it let's do it all right guys so <clears throat> this is how i did the listing right here um you see that i i told you earlier in this video how i would target the keywords right here tuesday 222 okay um and you can see it happen right here too as well um now remember the goal is you know as you're doing your keyword research in the niche right and learning about the niche so you can see how i did it but like using different variations throughout the listing to help you get traction and, and traffic to your listing is very important at the very beginning because that's what's going to help you make sales even if you run ads or even drive outside traffic to your listing you want to make sure you have solid keywords the reason being when it starts to make sales organically you're going to start to rank for certain keywords in the listing which so let's say for example you're ranking for you start to rank for february 22nd 222 that long tail keyword okay and then it starts to get sales but this long tail keyword right here has a search volume of a thousand then you're starting ranking closer to the front page you know it has a you know a thousand people searching for that long tail keyword for the month you start to rank close to the front page you're getting traction from that long tail keyword but not only that now you're getting traction from this keyword too and this has this long tail keyword has you know an, a search volume going up you know to the event it it has a search volume of 20,000 right so now everything adds up okay because the next thing you know you're making sales from this long tail keyword then you're making sales from this long tail keyword but the most important thing is here you have to make sure that it makes sense to the listing okay so you can see how i put this all together um as far as you know i was i told you at the very beginning that i was gonna you know my goal is to you know target that keyword and i have it throughout the listing and um you know you can see how i put different variations related to the day in here all right which is like i said very 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 powerful now i did the same exact thing to the other design too as well okay and i put the rm at the end so you guys can go and search for it i'll put this down below in the description okay and like i said let's see what happens and hopefully this uh this design makes a sell you know what i mean so uh, it's a, it's really interesting i'm gonna be creating more of this type of content for you guys to kind of just hold your hand and you guys can get a like an insight of how i would do it personally okay like with the previous video if you guys didn't go back and watch that previous video that design has made sales already okay and it's ranking now on amazon it's cool to have your design up there yes it's cool but it's not gonna do no good if it's not making no money now like oh yeah i put it up there and i'm not making no sales You need to focus on if you're going to go into these competitive niches, how are you going to make sales? All right. So that's very, very important when it comes to any of this stuff. That's the goal. Okay. So if you enjoy this type of content, check out my other content piece of content right here where I go into detail too as well of how to make sales on Amazon.